hi guys this is again Amy welcome back to my channel welcome to up my canal I know my face is looking like a golden trophy just because I have put on my liquid illuminator you guys know I've done my eyebrow so today I'm here to do a demo slash review but before we jump into this tutorial please don't forget to like comment subscribe and share and don't forget to follow me on my Instagram all the links will be down in the description box so today I'm here to do a demo slash review on this NYX um, eyeshadow palette um, this is like a really small eyeshadow palette they have the bigger ones so NYX come out with this small mini eyeshadow palette this one is in neutral warm and um, they have like different different if you're colorful I have the colorful um, one of this palette a bigger size I have it is somewhere there so I decided to pick up this neutral and I really really like it that this is very very small it's very travel friendly so I decided to come and do a demo since I didn't pick up the neutral one that came out with the last time I only pick up the colorful one and which I really like so now today I'm here to do a demo slash review I've already done my eyebrows with my Hema brow pencil in 09 and I use my Mab Nabla cosmetic um Hi, um, concealer to cut. So now I'm just going to like blend the concealer on 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 my eyes so that I don't have like any crease. So I picked this up from the Do class. If you guys want, you can check it out. I also pick up their foundation, but that is not yet here. Hopefully, I will get it today. Then so that tomorrow I'll come and do a demo for you guys. I pick it up on the internet just because. The do class um in the city in Arnhem they don't have the foundation yet, um so I couldn't able to go and test which one is my shade, but I just pick up from the, on the internet, so I hope that is good. So this is these are the shadows. They're really really. This is like a neutral, warm neutral. They're really really nice. I really really like them. You got you have like one, two, three, like four mattes and these two kind of like shimmery kind of ones, and I really really like come and show you guys close so yeah so now that I'll show you guys what the shadows look like so now it's time to put it on my skin so first I'm going to start with this um warm shade here I'm gonna use this to like put it all over my eyes Put it all over my eyes like on the outer corner I'm kind of like using this one to set my concealer instead of um, using powder and then come again and use this I'm gonna blend it on the outer corner a little bit so now that I've done that I'm going to take another brush sorry and I'm going to take this shade here next and I'm going to put that like on top just a little bit up well like towards my eyebrow and then you're just going to take the brush and blend both shades together to give you like a really smooth transition you guys see it's a very very smooth transition which I really really like so you're just gonna hold this brush take this the first brush you use and then just go again with the shade just pack it and then try to blend focus more on the outer so what's coming into the eyes and then blend but you see you have that smooth transition um, on top and then blend the outer corner so now that we're going to take this same brush just to blend the outer corner to get rid of any any dark line so now that we've blend that really nice so now what we're going to do we're going to take I'm, I'm looking for uh, like a small brush I'm going to take this dark shade here it's like a dark brown I'm going to focus it right on the outer corner just 
just to darken the color a little bit. And they're gonna bring it towards the inner corner. So now you're going to take that first brush you use and you're just going to like blend the top to get rid of any hash line. So now that it's done, you just go in again with that shade and just like trying to give it like a smooth transition. Go again with that same brown, take a little bit. And then now you're just going to dab it and focus on the outer corner. You're just going to dab, dab, and then blend. You're going to use the other side of the brush to just blend. This is a very, very simple look. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to take a more fluffier brush. I'm going to use this brush. I'm just going to blend everything on the top. And also bless any blend any hash line on the outer corner. So now that everything is blank, I'm gonna put the brush aside. I'm just gonna show you guys what I'm doing. I'm going to take my oil control settings, so I'm going to spray my brush just a little bit, and I'm going to take this shade first. You're going to focus it right here. It has a really nice um, pigment. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this shade also. And then I'm just gonna like put it here. It is quite a a very wow. This shade is so pigment. Okay, we're going to take that first shimmery, and then we're just gonna try to like blend. Blend the top to get rid of any hash line. So now you're going to take this brush and just try to like blend here everything. So now you have like a really smooth transition. You're going to take that first, that dark shadow you used to, and then you're just gonna like do like a swipe motion to blend the dark shadow and that shimmery shade you use so that you don't have like a harsh transition you guys see so you're going to take that fluffy brush you use you're going to blend so this is the eye you're going for so now what we're going to do i'm going to show you guys one more thing Mm. so now you guys have done with the eyes if you want to use highlighter you can I'm going to take your favorite highlighter i'm going to use this ofra cosmetic highlighter and you're just going to highlight your brow bone you want to go little by little with this highlighter So now you're going to take that transition brush you use and 
you're going to blend to just get a smooth transition you guys see so now what you guys want to do if you like to put highlight um highliner you can put your eyeliner I don't like to put eyeliner sometimes I do sometimes I don't now I'm just loving the no eyeliner look it makes my eyes a little bit bigger than when I put eyeliner so now what I like to do I just take my concealer and my brush and just shape my eyes use the concealer to like clean take a brush blend everything what I use I use the makeup revelation concealer in C15 that's what I use as a foundation you guys know I love this um, concealer so that what I use this concealer matches my skin so perfect i don't really need to mix it with anything and i just like the way my face look after using as a foundation so now i'm here to highlight i'm going to take this nabla cosmetic um concealer i also like this concealer i like the way it looks the way it feels i'm going to take more real technique sponge and i'm just going to blend So now that I have blend everything to get rid of any hash line I like to go in with my the brush that I use for foundation just to get rid of any hash line just around so now what I'm going to do I'm going to take my mixture this is um powder I use them um, I think my banana powder and my Oprah and um, W setting black Oprah setting powder I use this I mixed it so I really like how this look uh, it's a little bit um, darker than the normal banana powder so I really like it so I'm gonna take that and I'm going to set So now that that is done, I'm going to first set my entire face. I'm going to take this powder, I'm going to take my brush. I like to take this powder to wipe off all the excess powder. And you see the reason why I like to mix the powder because it gives me like a highlight, but it gives me this really um natural highlighter. It's not that my face on the eyes is looking so dull, my under eyes look bright. But it also looks very very natural so that's the reason why I like to sometimes mix my powder so now that that is done what I'm going to do I'm going to contour with my contour brush I'm gonna use my Elego contour powder you guys know I love this I'm almost out of it I'm gonna use that to contour I'm just going to blend everything to get rid of any harsh line. So 
so now that it's done we're going to do like a reverse contour i'm going to take this my powder and i'm just going right underneath there So now we're going to leave this one to set. I'm going to find a smaller brush and I'm going to do my on the eyes. I'm going to take this shade and I'm going to use it underneath my eyes. So now I'm going I'm going on top of it with this cool tone. I'm just going to take this big fluffy brush and I'm just going to like try to blend. So now it's done, I'm going to take my powder and just like wipe off this excess powder. So now that it's done, so what I'm going to do is So now I'm going to set my face first I'm going to use my Makeup Revolution Illuminating Setting Spray So guys, this is the finished result So lip, I use my Makeup Revolution Lip Planner, you guys know the dark lip liner and I use this LA Color lipstick, you guys know and that's what I use on my lips and highlight, I use the W7 highlighter and I use this dark shade just to like give myself some like bronzing because I've already used a liquid illuminator underneath my foundation the liquid illuminator I use was this sleek liquid illuminator I've done a review about this, go and check that video out so yeah this is the finished result and this is the eyes you guys can see it's very very simple um i really like this look i like this palette um for example if you're going on a weekend the, the reason why i picked this up i thought you know what i'm going on weekend and maybe i don't want to take a whole bunch of makeup with me this palette is super nice because sometimes i like neutral look i don't like like a really bold look if you know me i'm more like the neutral kind of thing and i think this would be a perfect um um palette for me to take with me for a weekend and this this illuminator also one of my favorite to take for a weekend so i thought this palette combination too many things too little people beautiful i really like it so yeah this is the eye look i really like this palette i can't wait to play with it more you can go for like a really nude um neutral warm look just using this um one two three colors you can use the three colors to go for like a neutral look warm neutral look if you guys want to see that video i'll come back and play with this palette and show you guys how to create like a neutral warm look but yeah this is how this look like i hope you guys like this video if you guys do please don't forget to like comment subscribe and share don't forget to follow me on my instagram on my facebook like page this is your girl amy forget not to abonneer forget my need to focus on my instagram kanaal op my facebook pagina hope ik jullie zo snel mogelijk te zien doeg bye